Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 549, where we have 45 moves to clear out 36 jelly. Now, the problem is the jelly you can see along the fringes are all trapped under this five and three layer thick frosting. We've also got ticking time bombs on the board and we've got mystery candies on the board. I don't have a very good setup, so I'm going to jump out and jump back in. This is my third playthrough for recording purposes. So I know that it's tricky, and I know that there's a, um, an element of luck involved on this board. And if I don't have a good setup to begin with, um, then things aren't going to bode well. But then, of course, even if I have a good setup, if I get awful mystery candies, I may be stuck as well. Here, I like this. Stripe draft combo right away. Nothing blew up at me. I'm going to be able to take out the ticking time bombs and open up these mystery candies and prompt hopefully more mystery candies to show up. Another stripe draft combo. I have to vacate these areas to get mystery candies and ticking time bombs to show up. Of course, I don't want the time bombs, uh, but I do want the mystery candies because even though they can be evil, I don't think I can win this board without... Uh, getting quite a few really cool matches and specials. And so I have to risk getting awful stuff in order to hope to get some good stuff every so often. Taking out the um, frosting where I can. And remember, we have to vacate these areas here. Well, and actually I think one side is mystery candy dispensers and one side is the ticking time bomb dispensers. I just can't remember which one was which. <laughs> we'll have to wait and see. I think this is the mystery candies. So I think this is the side I should be taking out. Well, let's just keep plowing through this. Oh wait, no, we got a ticking time bomb here. No, wait, we got a ticking time bomb here. Wait, where is it? Ticking time bomb's that side. Ticking time bombs this side. That just does not seem fear. I really thought that it was going to be one side or the other. All right, well, at least we're taking out these ticking time bombs. That's the other thing is that we have to be very cautious that we don't allow these uh, to get too low. It's very easy to allow that to occur, and especially when they're kind of down off the conveyor belt. They're not in the general population. I'm already worried about this one, but notice I don't really have any good moves to make. I have very few moves on the board. So when I can make a move down here, that's what I need to do. Let's see. I know I could have done that. I just... Okay, here we go. So now I'm making moves down here. Now I can take this out. I still don't know how to prompt the mystery candies to show up. Ooh, how could I get that to happen? I don't know. Let's do this. Because the more I have cleared out here, the more I can at least try to get those mystery candies to show up. Let's do this to get mystery candies. I got one. It's better than I have been getting. Okay, we're going to jump through here. Huh. Try to get more. Nope. Well, that was kind of nothing. I think it was just a chameleon candy. Let's see. I'm having a real struggle getting things cleared out in this bottom area, even being able to make moves over here. There we go. That looked nice. I'll make a stripe along here. Oh, I think I can get a stripe draft combo and this is really helpful to clear out a swath of three by three right down there at the bottom almost had another opportunity I'm getting more of these mystery candies now let's see I know I can make specials up here but now that I've got this open I need to focus my efforts down here I can make a wrapped or a stripe but I think I'm better off just knocking these things out and still trying to get those mystery candies, something really big. Let's see, I'm going to open this guy up. That was not helpful. 
see if this will pair up together. This is nice. It's not going to shoot all the way across the board, but it's going to do a lot of damage here. And we are getting more mystery candies flowing out. That's nice. Now I think I'm going to go ahead and take out all red. It's the uh, last... Oh no, I'm going to do this. This is the last uh, ticking time bomb that is set to do me damage. Those fish are being helpful. Fish always go for areas where they're needed. So that was it. We were able to beat it with the use of the uh, mystery candies. And it just took me, this was my third playthrough, because it took me that long to realize that I had to clear out these areas here to try to get the mystery candies. This was my first attempt to try to do it, which is why I didn't know exactly where those mystery candies were supposed to show up. And it looks like it's just a gamble. It's a, a lottery as to where they're going to show. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. If you have questions, please put those in the comment section. And as always, thanks for watching.